what you want. I'm busy. Excuse me. Deliveries to rare. LPD, I got a couple of questions. Hmm. Talk, talk, talk. Always talk. You wait. You know, take up time. Busy, busy. Marcus Eisendaler is dead. Uh, okay, we, we, we talk. Quick, quick, now. What you want? You were close to Eisendaler? Eisendaler? <laughs> no, no, no time for him. No go to a lab. Eisendaler tests off world gravity to work important organs. Visual center, you see? Marcus is dead. To work hard all night, all day, no stop, no break, no OT. Did you hear me? Of course I hear you. You think I'm deaf? <laughs> Your time more important, huh? Eisendaler dead. Maraji may be dead. You out chasing skirts. Maraji? You eat supper with Maraji every night, no fail. Sometimes Chinese, sometimes Indian, sometimes home cook. Sometimes we go up and eat with twins. Maraji didn't show. Did you call him? Hey, call? I knock. Ten minutes ago, door locked. No answer. Where you come from, huh? What? Nothing, nothing. Tell me this. Hey, wait. LPD, you there for something, huh? LPD? I'm very busy. I just won't wait for nothing. What's going on? Who did this? Help me, sir. Please, help me. It is going to blow. Run! Run! Hold on. An ambulance will be coming. You must warn the twins. Up there. The stairs. The twins? Did they do this? No. Tall men with red locks. The bomber. And a, another with beard. Piercing eyes. What did they want? The TNA information. To God forgive me. I told them, told them about the twins. Don't shoot. McCoy, Rep Detect, BR-61661. What do you know about this? Got a dead man here. Victim of an explosion. His name is, uh, was Maraji. He was able to give me a description of the two perps just before he bought the farm. Yeah? They skin jobs, or are you just in the right place at the wrong time? I'm practically waxing their tails, officer. I'm that close. But I don't have a lot of time. You mind, uh... Mopping up here? Just do me a favor and kick some rep ass, okay? It's high time someone got them illegals off the street. Appreciate it. This is 32 Sector 3 reporting a homicide. Possible act of terrorism. It was something you didn't see too often. A precise, shaped explosion fashioned for minimum collateral damage. The son of a bitch was a pro. Someone with real munitions expertise. And that expertise could only come with extensive, on-the-job, off-world training. Locked. No way through here. I recognized the logo on the envelope. It was definitely Runsitter's animal sales, but I didn't expect to find hundreds of chinion inside. I didn't know what it was for, but I'd bet the farm it wasn't on Runsitter's books. Hmm. Hello, 
Luther. Hello, Lance. You have no new messages and one saved voice-only message. Would you like to hear the saved message again? Absolutely. Hello, it's J.F. Sebastian. I hope you guys are all right. I tried to talk to Dr. Terrell about, uh, about your reinstatement, reemployment, but I haven't been able to get through to him yet. He's kind of angry, and you know what a cool customer he is. I don't know what happened between you guys, but I'm still trying. If, if, if you want to get together, I'm still at the Bradbury. I'll be here all night. Message saved automatically. To delete, please state your deletion security number. Not right now. Thanks. The pleasure's all ours at Sino Bell. The vid phone was one of those old Zenith jobs, the last electronic tech that was still produced on this continent, in Mexico to be exact. No wonder the sucker was on the blink. What? I'm busy. Listen to me. Busy, busy. You not delivery man. You go away. Distraction all day long. Never stop. Loud noises on the street. Beep, beep, boom, 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 boom. Always make me drop eyes. That'd be Dermo design burning to the ground. Oh? Huh? What? What of Marathi? He didn't make it. You leave now, okay? Very busy. Must work. Must work. <sighs> you mentioned twins. Yes, yes! Luther and Lance. Siamese twins. Live about Mirage. They're genetic designers? Were. <laughs> Till last month. Got the boot. Shit can. From who? Big boss, who else? Hey, and if I didn't tell up! You go ask them. I waste no more time. You think I, I nose around everybody's business, huh? What's Sebastian been up to lately? Sebastian? <laughs> he do what always do, nervous system. Very important to Dr. Terrell. Where do I find him? He had old building down the alley. Uh, Bradbury Hotel, I think. You walk down the alley, you find it. What about this Lance? What kind of guy is he? Why, he like Luther, only different. Don't know which which. That's so? One long hair, talk a lot, da, 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 da. always make deal. Other more quiet, work much harder. What kind of deals? Sell this, sell that, no matter what weather. Like salesman, <laughs> very hard to take, no trust, no way. Did Lance sell something to Runsetter? Who? Never heard of Runsetter. No time for charades. Sound like this, sound like that, uh, look like this. Uh, uh, oh, get me Miraji's some kind of DNA designer? Yeah, subcontractor like me. <laughs> he funny though, like old movies. Miraji master chef. Twins go crazy when he cooks. <laughs> It was some kind of freakish toy, half mechanical, half organic, rep technology for sure, but no one was going to give me any retirement bonus for it.
DNA research, incept dates, a lot of jargon, but I'd bet my spinner it was valuable to somebody. Oh, you think he found us, man? One of the design subcons must have talked. Unstable personalities, to say the least. Told you we should have blown up the old block. It would have created problems down the line. We got problem now, man. This one? He's not a problem. He's an opportunity. You're weak, my friend. I expected so much more from you. I'm thinking our brother not hearing too good. Oh, he hears us. Isn't that right, McCoy? You ready to give up fruitless nightmare man? Come back to family? He doesn't have a choice. He never did. Let me kill him, man. No. We got no time to be patient. Your woman, she be getting sick. I promise you, she'll not die here on Earth. I promise somebody will. Believe me, he's the least of our problems. You're talking crazy. The hunter be dangerous. A fool sees not the same tree a wise man sees. I'm no fool, man. You must have a little faith, my friend. Without contraries, there's no progression. How can you trust any of their kind? We have been manipulated by them, correct? Now they're going to see exactly what lies on the other side of the horizon. How long have I been here, Lucy? How do you know my name? I saw your things at Runciter's. Did you feel bad when they killed those animals? They were so pretty and sweet. I hoped Father wouldn't do it. But Mr. Runciter deserved retribution. That's what Father said. Why? Because he treated me bad, like I belonged to him. I'm sorry. Are you really the hunter? Like Father says? It's my job. Why? What do you have against us? Nothing. It's just... the law. Would you hurt me? I promise you I won't. <laughs> Father will be back soon. It felt and smelled like real cheese. Dairy products were choice contraband, scarce and mucho expensive. Selling them was a class A felony. Strange. Hysteria Hall was an arcade down near Nightclub Row. Nothing else there.
You let them in my room? They had a warrant, mister. What was I supposed to do? They took my pictures. Couldn't stop them. How about me? You think I'm easier to stop? Who the hell are you? McCoy, LPD. LPD, huh? Maybe you guys can return something to me. How do you know we got it? One of your own. Invaded my property. Bad haircut. Stupid coat. The other guy. What other guy? Go play dumb. What about him? Nothing. I just thought you were gonna arrest me, that's all. I don't care about your little run-in with the manager, okay? I'm looking for a couple of replicants. Can't help you there, friend. Maybe the clerk can tell me who was renting that room back there. Why were you hassling him? You let these creeps in my room. I'm a very private person. What have they got against you? Nothing, friend. I ain't done nothing. Well, we're all innocents, aren't we? Damn straight. And I don't like people asking questions either. Just help me out here a little more. You seen a big Rasta guy around here? Or a guy with a beard and dark eyes? A Rasta? What's that? He's got dreadlocks. Talks with an accent. Oh. No, I ain't seen no one like that. Look. My mother's waiting for me. You stick around. Maybe the manager will come back. I didn't know who was working this side of the pool, but whoever it was, they'd been pretty thorough going through the joint. I doubted if there was anything I could find that hadn't already been snagged and bagged. Holden's badge. The car looked a lot like the one I'd been tracking. The driver had been smart enough to pull the license plate, but the vehicle identification number was still there. If I ran it through the mainframe back at the station, I could ID the owner. The wrapper was from a vendor I knew. Best lichen dogs in the fourth sector. That wasn't saying a whole lot, but with an arcade next door and a dozen nightclubs down the street, Mia and Murray's stand saw more action in a night than my spinster aunt saw all last century. It was the pick still. He said Pat doesn't have a mink coat. She's got a good little puppy.